are here in Battle Creek, Michigan in Best Buy preparing for the Halo 5 launch, which we are excited beyond all reasonable doubt. We're here with the throngs of people lining up, getting ready to get their new fancy dancy game that they can play on their system. And this is another opportunity for me to get one if I can get a Xbox One, which would be cool. You got two, don't you? Yep, got two Xbox Ones. He has a PS4. And a PS4. I was just saying, like, if, you know what? I'm here with uh, this dude. Clovis Bordeaux. And this one over here. Jeremy Holder. And we are excited for this moment. It would be more excited if somebody would stop being greedy. But we'll go with what we are. They have a new terabyte version of Halo over there with uh, the game and the console. You know, this is a point where I don't like you, right? This, this is why I don't like you. But Halo is contentious. It is. It inspires a lot of energy from people on both sides. Halo is either going. For some, it's a make or break type scenario. For others, it's just another game in the box. Where are you at on this? Um, I would say another game in the box. Um, I would say not even a game in the box, a game that's way past its prime, a game that's copying off of a game that came out last year. To me, looking at this whole um, Halo franchise, this is kind of like when you think of Xbox, you think of this exclusive. A lot of people look at the fact that this kind of somewhat is the Mario of Microsoft. This is the it exclusive is not game the Mario that's Microsoft. only available on here. I mean, so to me, this is, it may not, if it fails, which I highly doubt it will, but if it does, it's not like it's the system is going to tank, but this is the, the game that hopefully will push Microsoft through the holiday season and give them the sales they need to get closer to Sony right now. Uh, if I uh, remember right, Sony's kind of thumping them in the sales. In it's, it's weird. I don't see how. I mean, but it is. Maybe it's because I've had to buy two of them because one of mine broke. Oh. Not that I'm even bitter. I still have my uh, launch PS4. Yeah. Day one edition, Xbox three, Xbox One as well. So. I think there's something to be said about this game as far as Halo has been a marquee title along with your uh, Gears of War. The games like that have been appear that those are things that have historically sold systems we need to talk to the people that are here now excited about this maybe they can help shore this this discussion up and figure out what makes the halo players so excited about doing what they're getting ready to do which is buy a nice shiny new copy of it i like that idea shall we yep let's go In all my years of command, I've never seen a more determined soldier than the Master Chief. You know his service record was unimpeachable. But he's not responding to orders, and he's setting these things loose. We created him. So we're responsible when we can't control him. When he recruits others to join him. The only thing worse than losing a hero is watching him turn against us. The official story is the Master Chief is dead. You, Spartan Locke, are the unofficial story. Your mission is go. Let's hunt him down. So we're in Best Buy and currently I'm enjoying my time here with y'all. The guy behind the camera is a horrible individual, and I just want you to know that. So, but he somehow conned you two over here. You guys have bags and stuff, and I don't, and I'm not even bitter about that. I'm not even bitter about that. What's going on? Like, what, what got you guys to buy this one? 
Tell them what's up, Brad. i uh, just kind of been playing Halo since Halo 1. Halo 2 really got me into the shooters and just kind of followed the series ever since. Man. So you've played everyone since, like even the ODST, the... the the ones that people went, eh, you Even are. the ones that people didn't like, I at least gave them a shot. I'm more of a Call of Duty player, but he got me into Halo, so. And Call of Duty being another franchise that we, for some odd reason, we buy every year. The same game over and over every year with just a couple upgrades. Did you guys see any of the upgrades on this one? From time yeah. to time. Yeah. Do you guys use a Forge at all? He I does like more to. than me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Did you see any of the, they, they, I was reading something that there were some changes or they were doing something to it. What is, what's, what, is, what do you do with the Forge? Um, one of the things I really liked that they did with Halo Reach is I like to make race maps. I did that. Um, I made smaller uh, one player, like 1v1 maps, stuff like that. So um, Halo 4 kind of lost me with that though. I didn't like anything with it. So I'm hoping that Halo 5 works pretty good for that. Right on, right on. It, I was hearing that you guys play competitively a little bit here and there. Yeah. Where are you at on that? Decent, I guess. <laughs> a lot of 2v2s. Right on. So you're the people that made it so then I stopped playing Halo. Y'all realize that, right? Probably. Possibly. Because mm-hmm. y'all were in the microphone, like in the headset, talking about, <laughs> oh, yeah, I own you. And then you called me names that I didn't like. And I'm not bitter about it. It's how we go fight when we leave. Sounds here. about like what that guy does. So Probably. you do the shoot, then he does the trash talking. That yeah, yeah, that's how it goes. Most team of the time. up like Voltron. I hate you both. I <laughs> seriously, I hate everyone here right now. You guys are really good at this. I like that. What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? Are you guys? Did you guys take tomorrow? No, unfortunately, I can't. Nope. So you guys got this game at midnight. You get to run home and start downloading the patch and not play it until tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. download and go to bed. Yep. So I don't have to download tomorrow. That's my theory. First thing, as soon as I get out of work, that's I'll probably be on it for the next several hours. Have you already like got with the, the loved ones? And like, okay, I, you're not gonna see me for a while. Are they aware of this, or are they feeling the Thankfully, mine will probably be playing with me. I'll be fighting over the controller most likely. Nice. You just leave him on the side of the road. You don't even need a girlfriend. <laughs> waste the money, waste the time. <laughs> You got issues, you know that, right? It's some level, like you, yeah. you don't even try anymore. You don't even try, you know. You, I just, don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I can appreciate that. It's some level, I can appreciate that, because you don't have to like actually try to beg or plead with anybody to buy you an Xbox One. Nah, I really just do whatever I want. <laughs> Man, I bet that feels great. It's awesome. Halo Universe. Do you, do you guys play the single player? Do you guys go through that all the way through, or do you are you multiplayer only? I say both. Definitely both. Get enraged in multiplayer and then just go to single player. Right up. I usually start out single player, get used to the controls, and then go to multiplayer. What have you thought about the story so far? It's going to be interesting to see what's going to happen to Master Chief. I mean, that's for sure. Kind of fell in love with him, so. I don't know. So are you not looking forward to the whole lock part? I'm just more interested in what's going to happen at the end. Is there going to be more than one ending? Is there going to be only one ending? What's going to happen? Oh. Same. Absolutely. Competitively, you guys are, are you guys ready for this? Are you, are you are you looking at that competitive? Are you going to go in fully in on that, or uh, where are you going to land on that? I am definitely. We played the beta and we did pretty good on beta, so I'm looking forward. Right on. Right on. My gamer tag's Tatsu Ryu seven six four. Right on. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't give me the eyebrow, dude. Like I want to do my chair. Like. You're gonna laugh though. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best. Jelly filling. Oh, Hit so me up. <laughs> <laughs> Get slayed out. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> this is what I. Four years of college for this. This is what I do. This is this is. <sighs> it's serious though. That's it. You know what? There's a space. At the point where so, I am getting worked like a job by a dude named Jelly Fillin. I don't know if I want to live anymore. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't know if I want to. I don't want to see you at the top of the leaderboard. Me at the bottom. I'll be at the top. This is why I don't play Halo anymore. If I was good, man. If I was good. 
back in the day when I had reflexes. Y'all have been absolutely phenomenal. I just want you to know that this is an opportunity. We do have these free gifts for y'all. Um, Sweet. You can... It doesn't matter. Just hit me up with one. <laughs> these are our... We made these special for you guys because we really appreciate you guys coming out and hooking us up with this interview. By far, we want you to remember at all times that if you don't need your copy of Halo, I will make the sacrifice of returning or recycling it for you. I'll even take the bag, and you get to keep the mask. That's how I show love, man. That's how I am. <laughs>